Hi everyone and welcome to NameHero.com. In this video tutorial, I wanna talk about why you should always use a reseller account when hosting multiple websites. So over the last decade in the web hosting industry, we've seen a lot of companies that offer web hosting for pennies in the dollar for unlimited websites. So if we could just take a look really quick at some of the big names out there. So example, HostGator, you can see their web hosting. It offers on all three of their plans unlimited domains. And same here at their um, other website, uh, Bluehost, owned by the same company. Websites one for the basic and then unlimited for the others. Now here at Name Hero, we offer this as well. Under our basic hosting, you can host unlimited websites with their business and plus. Now, if we get back over here, I'm gonna explain what that really means. So if you read my blog post here, and you can go to namehero.com slash startup, and you can read this explanation that I post. There's a couple of things. One is cPanel limits. Here at Name Hero, we limit each account based on the cPanel usage. So meaning each account gets its own allocated set of RAM, memory, CPU, files, and that's because everything at Name Hero is on our high-speed cloud. Um, we want your sites to be fast as possible. So if you assign an account its own cPanel, then it's going to have its own resources. If you have one cPanel and you add all these sites, then they're all going to be sharing the same resources. So you're going to run into resource limits, especially if you have a site that gets a lot of hits. The second big thing is security. Um, at Name Hero, we use technology called CageFS, which means each cPanel account has its own file system. So imagine the file system in like a cage, hence CageFS, and where the the user can only use that file system. They can't use, they're not using the, seeing the file system for the entire server, it's just for that account. So it keeps it incredibly secure. So if someone would gain access, let's say a hacker or evildoer, they gain access to your one cPanel, then they have access to all your websites and this can create major problems especially if they have um, ill intentions and, and we've seen this time and time again and I've talked about this before but it just seems like I can't get the point across um, as well as I would like so that's why I'm doing another blog post and another video on this each website needs its own cPanel account now we also talk about scaling if you have a website under your cPanel that blows up well, if you need to scale it over to its own VPS and you have 10 or 20 or 30 sites in one cPanel, then it's really difficult because we have to actually extract it and make a bunch of changes and it's really hard. But if you create each website in its own cPanel, then it's very easy. We just pick up the account, we move it over to a VPS and it can be scaled very easily. When we first started Name Hero, I personally didn't even want to offer our basic hosting packages because I didn't want people to confuse that. So if I go here to our basic hosting and look, because it offers unlimited um, website hosting, this doesn't mean for all of your clients. This means if you have multiple websites for your company, then you can host them in the same cPanel. So I list in my blog post, if you have a carpet cleaning business, for example, and let's say you have multiple locations and you need multiple websites, then it would make sense to have both those websites hosted under the same cPanel. If you need a lot of subdomains and stuff like that, it would make sense. But if, you're, if you have 10 clients, it wouldn't make sense piling all 10 clients into one cPanel. I really feel like over the last, not really the last decade, the last two decades, that the larger hosts, such as, um, I'm not gonna mention their names, but I'll show you them here. I feel like they've kind of marketed to unlimited hosting for everything, and it's really attractive for like $5 a month. But that's the downside, it's just not secure, and you end up having all these sites using all these same resources, and it just really never works out. The better way is, if you have multiple clients or multiple websites in multiple niches, is to get a reseller account. This way, you, have, you can create a, a separate cPanel for each client, and then that way everything is separate. That way you can give each client their own cPanel login, they have their own resources, they have their own security, and you're going to create redundancy, reliability, and security that your clients deserve. You're going to have a much better experience going about it that way. Let me demonstrate this actually by logging into my demo account, and I'll show you the difference here at Name Hero, um, how this looks. So I'm going to log in, and of course I've got the two-factor on. If you work with us at Name Hero, I really hope that you utilize our two-factor because that's the securest way to keep your account um, out of um, harm's way. 
make sure that only you have access. So once I get inside of here, I'm gonna click Cloud Web Hosting, and you're gonna see I've got two sample packages here. One's our Basic Plus, and one's our Startup. So our Basic Plus, this is for HalloweenCostumeBlog.com. This is best if you just have one website, or if you, if you do need multiple hosting, these are your websites, or the developmental websites. You're not having all your clients on it. You can see under Actions, log into cPanel, and under here, you can go to add on domains, and this is where you would add the domains that you want to add. Now, again, this is not intended to be for clients. This is intended for your own internal domains for the site. Um, so I really hope I get that point across. On the flip side, if we go back over here and we go to my services under Cloud Web Hosting, and we go to our reseller account, which our example was reselltalk.com, we can see we have our main cPanel, but we also have another login to Web Host Manager. This is what's going to create and deploy separate cPanels for your sites. So we can click List, and if I, I don't right now, I just have one cPanel set up for reselltalk.com. So that's just that cPanel. Now if I want to create another domain, I'll just go to create a new account and I would type the domain in here and this would create a whole separate cPanel for that domain. This is the most safest, the best way to go about it. And the fortunate thing here at Name Hero, it does not cost you an arm and a leg to get a reseller account. If you're doing things this way, and maybe you don't want to run a full-fledged reseller hosting business, maybe you don't want to be a web host, I understand that. Maybe you're an affiliate marketer and you just need hosting for multiple sites. I get that. I've been there. That's why we have our startup package. For as low as $9.57 a month, which is even cheaper than some of our um, basic hosting packages, you can have a reseller account, you can host unlimited websites, and the only thing you're limited on is your storage. If you run out, if you get the 50 gigabytes, well, we can upgrade you to the corporate or the entrepreneur to upgrade your space. This is by far, again, the safest and best practice to hosting unlimited websites on your shared hosting account. And as I said, if one of the sites blows up, it needs its own VPS, we can easily extract that one cPanel, move it to, to its own VPS, and you have 0% downtime. No cut, your customers don't even realize it, the visitors don't realize it, and everything runs smoothly and as intended. So if you're watching this video and you say, Ryan, I have multiple sites, I need to host them. I'm telling you right now, my advice is you need a reseller account. Um, our basic hosting packages are great, but that's intended for one website or one business, not for multiple clients. And, and um, it's been very confusing over the years with the big name providers saying, well, we have unlimited everything for $2 a month. Well, that's the reason why it's $2 a month, because it's really not unlimited everything, and it's um, really a, a bad marketing practice. So I hope this video clears it up. I hope my blog post clears it up. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to me. You can comment on this video. You can comment on my blog post, or you can reach out to our team here at Name Hero. We're here 24 hours a day, seven days a week, 365 days a year, live chat, telephone, or our ticket system. We'd be happy to consult with you and help you find the best solution for all of your websites. Just let us know. But thanks a bunch for using NameHero.com and best of luck hosting all of your websites.